Hello everybody, it's Amel, and today I'm going to teach you how to solve the plus one problem. Given a non-empty array of digits representing a non-negative integer, add one to the integer. The digits are stored such that the most significant digit is at the head of the list, and each element in the array contains a single digit. You may assume the integer does not contain any leading zero, except the number zero itself. So as you can see, here they give you two examples. In this example, the input is this array that has the elements 1, 2, 3. This array represents the number 123. So the method returns 124 as an array, because you have to add 1 to the number. In this example, the input is this array 4321. The method adds 1 to the number, so the output is 4322 as an array. So how can we solve this problem? We can go from right to left and we have to add 1 to the number, but we have to take into account that there could be a carry. If the number is less than 9, we add 1 and, we, and that's it, we're done. But if the number is 9, when we add a 1 to 9, if we add 1 to 9, then that becomes a 10, so we have 0 and a carry of 1. So without further ado, I'm going to show you how to write the code. First, I need a variable integer n gets a value of digits dot length. Alright, so now I'm going to go from right to left in the number for integer i gets a value of n minus 1. So i starts here. i is greater than or equal to 0 minus minus i. So as I said, if the digit at position i, if this digit is less than 9, I just have to add 1 to the digit and I'm done. So if digits sub i is less than 9, then add 1 to the digit plus plus digit sub i and I'm done so return digits which is the final result. So that was the simple case. Now if the digit at position i is not less than 9 it means that it has to be 9. If we don't return here that means that the digit at position i is not less than 9 so it has to be 9. So if it is 9 then the result, the digit at position i in the result becomes a 0. Digit sub i gets a value of 0. And we have a carry of 1. So in the next iteration, what we do is that if the digit is less than 9, we add a carry and we are done. But there's also another case. If all the digits in the input were 9, for example, then we are going to break out of the loop and all the values in the result, all the digits in the result became zero. So we have to have we have to take care of the carry. We have to put it at the beginning of the final result. So in that case I have to make a new array, an array of integer result gets a value of new array of integer of size n plus one. Then I just need to add a one at the beginning so result sub 0 gets a value of 1 and I just return the final result. That was the case where all the numbers, where all the digits in the input were 9 because you are going to break out of the loop and then all the digits in the result became 0 but you have a carry so you add a carry at the beginning and you have to make a new array with one more available spot to put the 1. So now I'm going to run the code It seems to work fine. I'm going to submit a solution. All right, this is working perfectly. If you like the video, please press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.